Well, a Sterling Heights homeowner doing some yard work this morning had just left to help his dad when a speeding pickup truck slammed right into the house. Yeah, and sadly, that driver of that truck died at the scene. And 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig has more on what she's learning from the victim's family. This crash has just devastated a Sterling Heights family. The victim lives just about a mile away, and he told his parents he was going to the bank this morning, but he died here in the crash. Relatives of the 48 year old victim devastated, but thankful no one else was killed or injured when his pickup truck crashed into the side of this home that sits on the north side of 19 Mile Road, just west of Mound. According to the driver's parents, everything seemed fine with him this morning, but they say police told them their son may have suffered a heart attack while driving north on Hanks Lane, causing him to lose control. It appears he struck this mailbox and continued north at a high rate of speed. Thankfully, no one was in the path of the pickup truck when he got to 19 Mile Road, going across the lanes, striking the grassy median and colliding into the side of this house. The victim's parents tell me six months ago low sodium caused him to have a seizure. This morning they say he ate very little for breakfast, but everything seemed to be okay. He finished a job, came home, and left to head to the bank when he crashed. His parents could not have imagined when he left, it would be the last time they saw their son. At any given time during the day, 19 Mile Road here near Mound can be busy. Thankfully, no one else was harmed in this crash. Sterling Heights police are continuing to investigate. In Sterling Heights, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. All right, Kim, thank you. Bye.